Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So I do have a massive haul. It is a collective haul from several different stores. So go ahead and grab a snack so we can go ahead and get into this haul. First store that I'm gonna share with you all is Target. Um, only went into Target to see if they had any Clorox wipes available. I had some luck last week in finding some. So I wanted to go back and see if they had any more. They didn't necessarily have Clorox wipes, but they did have some of the wet ones big wipes extra thick antibacterial hand wipes removes um from hands paint grease and glue so you get 65 wipes in there they had a limit of one per customer so we were able to get one a piece while i was in there i also grabbed some of these exfoliating cotton rounds i really like these exfoliating cotton rounds from um target And then at Target, we also just got some of this whitening gum, the Trident White Gum. So at Dollar General is the next store. Um, at Dollar General, I picked up this random Christmas ornament. It was $1, and I thought it was really cute. It says, Oh Holy Night. thought this would be a nice addition to our Christmas tree. Um, Christmas is around the corner. I know some people don't want to think about it yet, but it is creeping up on us. So I did pick that up. I grabbed one of these humongous flavored lip balms. I've never seen one this big before. Um, it is in the Nerds flavor and it was $2. So I wanted to pick that up just to have it. And we also picked up, we actually got two of these. This is the uh, Body Fantasies in the Gingerbread Latte. They only had it in the small size. I really have been wanting some fall body fragrances, but not really wanting to spend um, bath and body work type of money, you know, so I wanted to pick that up. Um, they had some hand sanitizer available in this cute little uh, cover. So I got one of the elephant and this one is the, what is that? Fluffy marshmallow. And then we got two of the panda. That's so cute. And this is the vanilla cupcake frosting. Two of those. And then let's see. Feel like, am I missing something from Dollar General? No, that's every, no, one more thing from Dollar General is this candle. So this is a maple pumpkin candle. It's a three wick candle. I grabbed that, it was $5. Now from Michael's, I went in there briefly to get this uh, decorative mesh to make my wreath. Um, Dollar Tree does sell the pink mesh during like Valentine's season in February, that kind of thing. And I have some, however, their decorative mesh has red strings going through it, like little ribbon strings. And I didn't want that in my wreath. So I went and got one of the celebrated um, decorative mesh rolls. And this is five and a half inches by 45 feet. This was $10. Quite a bit of that in there. So that'll last me for a while. Michaels, I also picked up just some things that I saw on clearance, which is this sticker pack. It is a Joey's Boutique Christmas sticker pack. I thought that was really cute to do some Christmas crafts with. Look at that little wreath. That is so adorable. So I also picked up a packet of the recollection stickers. I got this mainly for planner stuff. This is $4.99. You get 165 pieces of the stickers in there. Thought those are really cute. So I went ahead and grabbed them. And I also grabbed a mini sticker, not a mini sticker, a mini paper pad. So these are the six by six paper pads. People use these for scrapbooking, that kind of thing. I use them for paper crafting and planning. So this is the Holiday Homestead. They don't quite have all of their um, Christmas stuff out just yet. But from the stuff that they did have out, those were the items that I wanted to pick up for my kids. Now I did miss a couple of things here from Dollar General. We got some of those twin pack automatic air freshener refills. Those are $5 in the fresh linen. And then we got some black duct tape. So that was from Dollar General and I covered Michaels. So let's move on to Dollar Trees. At Dollar Tree, we got a lot of good stuff. Um, we picked up some of this home store shower cleaner. It's a foaming shower cleaner. So we grabbed that. We also picked up some of the Arm & Hammer body wash. We like that. It's a vegan body wash. So grab some of the Reynolds wrap. This is at 18 square feet. So you get 20% more for a dollar. And y'all know I said every time I go to Dollar Tree, I'm going to pick up a package of toilet paper to add to our uh, pantry. So I wanted to do that. Also picked up some of the hefty sliders in the uh, quart size. You get eight of those in there. And I got the gallon size. You get six of those in there. So that's nice to add to our pantry at dollar tree we also picked up some of the swan 
nail polish remover. It's 100% acetone. And then I found another one of these snuggle things. So this one is the, in the Cozy Evergreen. So these are the special or limited edition air fresheners by Renews It. We also grabbed this box. It's the Day of the Dead decorative box. You can open it up and put things in it, that kind of stuff. So we thought that was really cool. And you can open it with one hand, but that's okay. So it's a very cute box. It's what the bottom of it looks like. I love the colors on there. We also picked up some of these Day of the Dead signs. So we got this one right here and it's wearing a hat. And then we got another one that's wearing a flower crown. So you can stick those out in your yard. They're like yard uh, stakes. And we also got some candy. So we got some of the Twizzlers and the snack size. Some Reese's miniature cups. And some of these Skittles and the wild berries. And then we got this dish here. It's a plastic dish. And it is a day of the dead like serving dish. You can put different things on there. So we grabbed that. I also picked up some of these scarves. So I grabbed this infinity scarf. It is purple and it has like a skull and crossbones on it. And I have a shirt to go with it for Halloween. And then I also grabbed, now this is not an infinity scarf. It's just a regular one. And it has um, jack-o'-lanterns all over it. It's got a black background on it. I also picked up some of these stickers. These are like the laser stickers. I know these are not everybody's favorite, but I got them to go in my planner. You get 35 pieces of the stickers. Maddie picked up some of these um, nitrile coated gloves, safety gloves. So those are, I feel like those are new, I'm not sure. She grabbed a pair of those. And we got some of this Suavitel fabric softener. All this stuff is still from Dollar Tree. We got some of this hand sanitizer. It's got a cute little cover on there. And it doesn't really say, Hold on, let me close the lid because it was about open. Um, let's see what scent it is. Black cherry scented. Says it right there on the tag. So the one that says love on it with the purple cover is black cherry scented. Uh, the rainbow cover one, it says dreamer. That one is tropical berries scented. Those are good to clip onto your, um, your purse, your lunch bag, work bag, whatever the case is. Um, this one says shine on. That's really cute with the pink cover. And that one is, let's see, pineapple paradise scented on that one. Um, there's also, I think one more, unicorn. That's really cute with the pink. Great time to get stuck in stuffers right now as well. This is sweet pea scented. So that'll be my favorite one. I love sweet pea scent. And that's what the unicorn scent is. Grab some of these LED tea lights and they are ghost shaped. There's a two piece of the tea lights, 120 hours each. Also grab some batteries. We got some of these AA alkaline batteries by each circuit. Also some of the AAA alkaline by each circuit. Then I saw these at the cash register and I had to get them. I had originally saw them in Dollar General, but they wanted $3 a piece for them. I just don't think they're worth that. So these are the no key touch things. You know, you can open the door or um, press buttons, that kind of thing to keep your hands from touching anything, keep the distance between your hands and dirty surfaces. Um, I just got the last two that were left. So people have been buying these like crazy. So it's just a black and white polka dot one. And this one kind of has blue and yellow and purple in it. So I got one of each for us. Well, I just grabbed whatever they had left, so. And then I got this little basket here, and you will see this basket again in a video. So this is, uh, I think, Home Essentials brand. So we'll go over what I'm using this for in a video later on in the week. So the last part of the haul is from Walmart. So y'all know we've been trying to stay away from Walmart, but we wanted to go in there for something, and we got sucked in, and we ended up buying a few things that we saw. So let's go into it, or let's get into it. Um, Maddie picked up some of this Vanilla Body Fantasies. She just got the small bottle just to have a little spray, an extra one. And she also got this, um, it's a knockoff of the Viva La Juicy by Juicy Couture, and it's called Rocket. So she likes these little aerosol sprays, I think that's what you call them. And she wanted to pick up this All May eyeshadow. So this um, palette is called Mulberry Moonlight. 010, zero, zero, so 10, number 10, duh. And the Mulberry Moonlight is what the, um, I was about to say the scent, but that's the color shade. 
We also got some of the Sally Hansen Advanced Hardest Nails. It's a clear top coat and it's to strengthen your nails. Picked up some of the Kiss uh, Black Lash Glue and Eyeliner in one. So I've never worn uh, fake eyelashes before and I thought this would be an easier way for me to do it since this is like an eyeliner form. You just put it on, it has a matte finish. Um, it says an easy touch up. So that should be cool uh, by the Kiss brand. And the color is black. And I bought some of these Kiss lashes. It says it looks so natural, lightweight, and comfortable. Um, this is in the, um, I guess the type is called Shy, or the name of them is called Shy. They have like more dramatic lashes, but I just wanted these right here and try them out. So you get five pair. Picked up some of the Cavada Master Brew Kombucha and the Pineapple Peach. And then also one in the Blackberry Hops. So we'll see how that tastes. And we picked up the movie Three from Hell. Um, Maddie has wanted to watch this. I've never seen it before, so we will see how that goes. It's a Rob Zombie movie. I'm um, guessing like a horror movie. So we'll check that out. I'll probably watch that tonight. And we also got some uh, lunch meat. So we got some of the Honey Smoked Turkey Breast by Land of Frost. It's premium turkey breast. It's a pound of it. And then uh, for me, we got some of the oven roasted chicken breast. Picked up some of the Great Value uh, Linen Fresh Fabric Softener. And then I picked up some of the Summer's Eve Fragrance Free. Um, I love this uh, feminine wash from Walmart. That's the only one that I buy from there besides the Honey Pot. So I just got some of that. Uh, we also picked up some Vitamin C Gummies by Spring Valley. And I grabbed this to try it out. I believe I've had it before in the past. It's the Bolt, Bolt House Farms Daily Green Smoothie. So we'll see how that is. Let y'all get a view of all of that good stuff. So here is one of my favorite parts of the haul, y'all. Look what we found. Now, I don't know if it's going to fit on my fat wrist, but I'm definitely going to try. But if it does not fit, it will be something that I'll have in my collection. So it's a Star Wars Mandalorian watch. It is the cutest thing ever. And it's a flashing LED watch. Watch. I said watch. It's a flashing LED watch by Disney. So I love that. I think it's the cutest thing. Even though it's green and black, I don't care. It has Baby Yoda on it. So I had to have it. This was $6.88. So I'm guessing it's a kid's watch. I'm going to try and still maybe do it on like the last little hole to see if it'll fit my wrist. I have a feeling that it won't. Not hurt anything to try it out and see if it will fit. So I got that. They had another pattern as well. If I can find the other um, design of the watch that they had, I will link it down below because it is the cutest thing. I wish I would have took a picture or a video of it for y'all to see. But that one was really cute as well. So if you're looking for ideas on things for Christmas, um, it's definitely good to always check Walmart and see what little things they have that your kids or your family members may like. Um, Glade had out some of these new fall and winter type of sprays. So I picked them up. We got the Glade spray in the fall night long. It's limited edition. So we'll see how that smells. I didn't spray any of it because I had a mask on. So we also got the Pine Wonderland. I'm sure it just smells like pine. It says notes of pine, uh, Jupiter, and mistletoe. Juniper and mistletoe. Um, this one has notes of crisp fall air and smoldering woods. Okay. <laughs> and then this one right here is the pumpkin spice things up. So notes of pumpkin and caramel spice. Let's see. What else do we have over here? So I picked up me just one of these puffs, a bath puff. And then Maddie got one of these Rick and Morty t-shirts. Um, they had some bags up front on clearance. So Maddie picked up one of these purses. It was $10 on clearance. It's a cute purse. Um, it has like a crossbody strap and it's just black and it has this kind of, um, what do you call it? Copper? I'm not sure. Like copper, um, hardware on it. It's got a lot of compartments on it as well. This would be great for a work bag to put your laptop in as well. And then the last thing we got here is a backpack. I had to set this up so y'all could fully see it. This is a Swiss Tech backpack and it was originally $28.44. I believe we got it for 
uh, 10 or $11. So it has organizational pockets, a padded bag, padded shoulder straps, and a laptop sleeve. And Maddie got this for her work backpack so she could put her computer and different things that she needs for her job into the backpack. So we're happy to find that on clearance. That's everything that we picked up from all of these stores. What was it? Target, Dollar General, Dollar Tree, um, Michaels, Walmart, quite a few stores. I wanted to put it all in one so I didn't have a bunch of three minute videos up on my channel. So um, thank y'all so much for watching. I appreciate all the love and support. Make sure you give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I will talk to you again in the next video. Bye.